What is up, Aqua Beast? Welcome to the college life. Uh, it's been a while since we've been on YouTube, but I am here uh, in college at uh, UNCW in North Carolina. And this is uh, where I've been living the last couple months. Um, but, uh, but yeah, so basically, I'll give you a little tour of the college life. Got the bed, you know, dress your typical stuff. Got to represent the, the Bearcats back home over here. You know, all this stuff. You got to do a bunch of not fun schoolwork. We got the lovely whiteboard. We're still out here on the ocean. <clears throat> and then, uh, you know, closet. But basically, I've been slacking the last couple months. I was getting adjusted to classes, everything. But I'm back on YouTube. I'm going to start posting it on Instagram. I've been very busy, but we're going to make it happen. Today's video, I'm finally going to set up a fish tank in the dorm room. This is, it's just a three gallon little tank I had to set up back at my house. And uh, so we're going to set this bad boy up. We're going to get fish for it plants for it set it up all in this video over a couple days but it feels good to be back we're finally well we're here at college and uh let's get setting up this fish tank all right so i just rinsed off the sand which i recommend doing just so it doesn't really fog up your tank but that was pretty difficult to do and you don't really have your own sink so i'll see how this goes but it should be just fine i actually went with black sand this time which i think should look really slick with some green plants on it i'm going to uh three guys on to the gopro right here and uh, we'll get a little time lapse rolling as I uh, escape the tank, which I'm excited to do. All right, so I got the whole thing escaped. I'm kind of picky when it comes to that, so it took me a little while, but I think it, it's got a ways to go, but trust me, the live plants will make all the difference when we get there. Kind of got some little caves back through there under all these rocks and all the driftwood but like i said the live plants coming in in the front and in the back corner should really bring it home um the live plants will really make it pop but uh so now for the fun part let's uh fill it up all right so the tank is completely filled up and i actually i scooted it back into the corner i wanted in uh like i said it's definitely gonna need some live plants and little touch-ups maybe a couple extra rocks but for now i got i like the the basic uh scape anyway let's uh let's plug in the filter heater and lights I have to retake it now. Let there be water. <laughs> All right, so we originally, everything's filled up and plugged in. We were originally gonna put it right here, but then I realized that I liked it a lot better right here at the desk. When I'm doing schoolwork and stuff, I can see it, and it fits in that corner really well. Plus, when you're on this side, which you can't see because the light's not on yet, really good view of the tank um, from underneath. So that, that gives it a better two view. But uh, it always looks way better when you get the LEDs on. So uh, let's turn the lights off and turn her on. Oh yeah, looks so much better with the LEDs on. Just, that that looks really good right there at the desk. Lights it up a little bit too. Looks so much better. I really like the black sand, especially on the uh, wooden tabletop. It's looking so much better. And uh, I will catch you guys when I am finally gonna get plants and fish for this bad boy. Right, what is going on, Aqua Beast? We are back at the dorm. It's been a couple of weeks. The tank inside should be like fully cycled. And uh, today, we're gonna go get some fish for it, finally. All right, let's see what they got inside of the store. I've been in here once, um, just briefly, like when I first got here, so um, let's check it out. Some awesome saltwater tanks. Just look at these corals. Amazing. I'm gonna get used to seeing a lot more uh, saltwater stuff here in North Carolina, I'm sure. But some awesome saltwater tanks. Let's see what we got freshwater. This is a gorgeous tank. Fortunately, none of that is for sale. Ooh, they got some big guys. Making me miss my big Oscar back home right here. See what they got little fish wise i'm looking for like cardinal tetras and stuff Ooh, awesome golden nugget pleco right there uh, let's see some tin foil barbs um really cool figure eight puffer he's pretty cool i technically could get him for the three gal but i'd just be him pretty much awesome blue crayfish 
Ooh, oh, oh, that's awesome. Axolotl, really cool. I used to have one a few years back. They're so awesome. I might get one for the door. Oh, actually, they got another Axolotl. I definitely might end up getting one of those for the dorm room. Um, we'll see though, but stay tuned for that. Let's see. Cichlids. Got some live plants. Looks like there's a lot of corals over here. All right, so owner, super nice guy in there. He was just telling me that they get fresh water in on Friday, so they're kind of low on stuff. Um, but yeah, I, I, there was really like no cardinal tetra or anything. So uh, might actually go see what else I can find around here. It might even just be a Petco or something. Um, I still got to figure out all the cool fish stores around here. But uh, nothing there, but uh, we're going to keep looking. So uh, we'll catch you at the next place. All right, so I made it to the next fish store called Pet Supermarket, which we don't have back home in Ohio in the north. So I'm kind of checking it out for the first time. But uh, looks like they got some solid fish. Some big cichlids going on. Koi, goldfish, Ooh. guppies, some nice, some really nice plants in all these tanks. Just really good looking. I'm still looking for like cardinals or neons. Oh, they got a black, they got a black ghost knife. I'm definitely gonna get some snails of some sort. Let's see. Ooh, I might, I might get a clown pleco too, actually, for the tank because they don't get too large. And by then, I should have another tank to move it to. Cichlids, cichlids. Oscars. Yeah, so basically, there's actually a nice little selection here. I think I'm going to end up with the Pleco, some Neons, then snails and plants. So um, I'm going to see if I can get some help, and then uh, we'll get them back to the dorm and uh, get it rigged up. I'm pretty stoked, though. Thank you. All right, so I got everything back. Got the tank here. It's just a nice little three gal. I got three neons, a little pleco that won't get too big, and then two snails for now. Um, but basically, I'm going to get in all the live plants, which should look ridiculous. And uh, then I'm going to acclimate the fish, and we'll get them in there. I'm pretty stoked. It's been months since I've had a fish tank, which is weird to me because if you've seen my videos, you know in the fish cave, I've got over a thousand gallons of water. So, you know, I miss the fish back home, but I am stoked to have some back in the dorm room. And, uh, you know, it'd be nice to have some more content. All right, so the 15 minutes are up. I got them right here. We're gonna use the good old bucket. And we're just gonna, you know, open the bag, pour the water through, water goes through the net, fish get caught in the net, and we're gonna put them in the tank. Um, but yeah, no, I'm, I'm stoked to actually finally, finally get some fish in here. It's weird having no fish for months. It's not like me. All right, let's get these guys in. All right, get everybody. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh, that clown is sweet. Oh man, the clown's looking a little skinny though. I'm gonna have to feed it, bulk him up quick. Here we go. Though. Everything is in. I'm gonna get the GoPro out and get this uh, cleaned up a little bit. I'll show you guys the final results. It's looking good. What is up? So I'm actually, I am back at the uh, house. This video was filmed so long ago and I did not even end up filming the tank again. Um, the tank was actually great. The fish did well. A couple of them actually made it back to the fish cave, which is cool. Um, but yeah, basically I'm back and I'm gonna hit the YouTube. So make sure to watch. Gotta catch up. I got a lot of hard work to do and a lot of things to show you in the fish cave and a lot of fishing adventures. So I'll get ready for this summer. But uh, I do have a couple little short clips to show you the little tank before it's over. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll uh, catch you a lot this summer. Position is. Let the. <laughs>